I don't from her. Come in. All right. Okay, even if she wasn't 17, I never knew that girl. What's going on, bro? I heard you wanted to see me. I never knew that girl. Have a seat. All right. Have her grandmother call me in and I'll sign it. Okay, we'll sign the paper. We'll sign the paperwork. Donnie. What up, dog? It's more than a weed, man. We told all the fans and we told everybody the album's gonna be coming out in April. At the rate you're going, we're not gonna be done. I understand you in the streets doing your thing, but it's gonna come to a point where you gotta pick, man. You're gonna have to miss some of them sales. You're gonna have to not drink some of that juice to be here in the studio and make some music, Donnie, man. We can get rich off this shit, dog. All right, man, I understand that, bro. I understand that, man. But right now, dog, we gonna push that more than the weed man back, dog, and drop this next project I got coming out. Next project? Yeah, my next project I got coming. What's the next project? And I got a lot of new shit going on with me right now, you know what I'm saying? Got that more than the weed, man. That was supposed to drop in April. But instead, you know what I'm saying, I'm going to drop that Juice Nation. You know what I'm saying? April 22nd, we going to push that more than the weed, man, back. Just a little bit, you feel me? Sorry for the fans, you feel me? You know what I'm saying? We going to get that going. Get that Juice Nation. Drop that April 22nd. That was supposed to come out April 6th, you feel me? But like I said... I pushed that back because I wanted to do this Juice Nation, you know what I'm saying, for the hood, you know what I'm saying, because I felt like I had to represent for my hood niggas, you know what I'm saying, and my album, More Than The Weed, man, that's going to be like more on the mainstream tip, you feel me, so we pushed that back and we're going to drop that Juice Nation April 22nd. I really don't give a fuck about what the critics saying. How I feel about haters saying that hey, I drink too much lean, you know what I'm saying? I ain't hurt nobody but my body, you feel me? I feel like shit, niggas mad, they can't afford the shit out there, you know what I'm saying? It's a hundred dollar spray. That's how I feel, niggas can't afford to drink high drink. So, you know what I'm saying? They take that, they hate. So, you know what I'm saying? I guarantee you if they had the money, you know what I'm saying, for this hot, they'll be drinking just like me. You know what I'm saying? So don't get mad, why you drinking this? Why you drink all day? I ain't hurt nobody but my body, bro. Why you mad? Uh, no, I really don't want to speak on that, you know what I'm saying? I really don't even want to mention the nigga name, because that's all he want, you know what I'm saying? It's to mention the nigga name, you know what I'm saying? Niggas know where I'm at. Goofy ass nigga. You know what I'm saying? Niggas know where I be Bitch. all day, every day. You feel me? I mean... Soft ass nigga. Niggas want to, you know what I'm saying? They see us shining, they see us doing our thing, you feel me? So niggas want to mention our name, you know what I'm saying? To get they little clientele, they little 13, 14 views, tops on, on YouTube, you know what I'm saying? But hey, I'm not gonna mention the nigga name because that's all he wants, so I'm not gonna get niggas what they want, man. I'm not worried about these niggas, man. Fuck these niggas, man. I'm gonna keep doing me, dressing fly, drinking lean, smoking weed. You know what I'm saying? You know what it is. Flew, how you feel about the beef, man? Next question, man. Next question. We're gonna speak on niggas and all Next that. Next question. Fat ass niggas, man. More than a weed man. I mean, because of me, I feel like I'm I I'm, I am more than a weed man. You feel me? First and foremost, I'm a father to my two sons, three sons to be. You feel me? I got a son on the way. Yeah, y'all didn't know that. Yeah, I'm a father first and foremost. But on the side of that, I also have lean. I also have pills. I also have this. I also have music. I also have clothing lines. You feel me? So I'm more than a weed man. Niggas look at me like I'm just a weed man, like I'm supposed to ride around. You know what I'm saying? Niggas get mad when I, like I don't have a personal life. You feel me? Like niggas want me to ride, like niggas think I'm supposed to get them high all day, every day. I'm not supposed to have a life. I don't have a personal life. I'm supposed to just get them high. Like damn, I mean, if I'm not answering the phone, I'm not answering the phone. If I say I'll be there, I'll be there. You feel me? So, you know what I'm saying? That's 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 why I labeled it more than a weed man. Cause I want, it, I want all my fans, all my family, everybody to know that I am more than a weed man.
we did own a store in Northland, but you know, being the fact that, you know, Northland is about to close now, you know what I'm saying? We sold it to a business partner of mine, you know what I'm saying? And let him do his thing with that, you feel me? We got some new things dropping, you know what I'm saying? With that Roy Raps world, where, you feel me? We got that coming out, so you know what I'm saying? Be looking out for that, you feel me? Once we get a nice location, we'll be sure to, you know what I'm saying? Get that in motion. No, I'm not single. Like I said, I'm a family man. You feel me more than a weed man. What's up, Kalia? Shout out my baby. I see you. You know what I'm saying? No, I'm not single. You feel me? Uh, why wouldn't I write my own lyrics? Niggas say that I sound like my brother, you feel me, when I rap. But you know what I'm saying? Me and my brother, we've been through the same shit. We go through the same shit. You know what I'm saying? This is my brother. He been there with me. The same shit we talk alike. Niggas hear me on the phone say, Damn, nigga, I thought you was your brother. That's because we sound alike, you feel me? So, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I write my own lyrics. <coughs> Hello? Hold on, I'll take this one. Hello? What up, dog? Yeah, I got some juice. What's the deal? What you need, my nigga? Shit, uh, Alright, bet. <laughs> Next question. How old was when we when we performed on 106 in Park? We was young as hell. How old was you? You was 13. I was 13, so that means you was 12. I was 13 when I performed on 106 in Park. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? Rock the show. It was like a competition. I'll never forget that shit. Me and Chill came out first, you feel me? Rock the show, you feel me? Then Khan and PA came out, you know what I'm saying? Did their thing. You know what I'm saying? It was a, it, it was a moment to remember, dog. I'll never forget that shit. Funnest shit in the world, bro. That's why I'm doing this shit now. You feel me? For the love of that. You feel me? Just that feeling on stage, you know what I'm saying? Well, hood I'm from, man. I'm really a six mile nigga, you feel me? But I lived on Finkel, you know what I'm saying? All my life, you feel me? So I got love for my Finkel niggas, my six mile niggas, my seven mile niggas, my eight mile niggas, you feel me? My Joy Roll niggas. I'm from everywhere, you feel me? But you know, I'm a six mile nigga by heart. You know what I'm saying? But I get love in every, every hood, you feel me? You know what I'm saying? Go on Joy Roll niggas, know my name, you feel me? Eight mile, my name good, you feel me? Seven mile, that's where I be at. Six mile, that's where I be at. Finkel, that's where I be at. PA, I'm everywhere. You feel me? I'm working, baby. I mean, you know what I'm saying? Like I said, I ain't no hating ass niggas, you know what I'm saying? Shout out Doughboy, shout out Team E, you know what I'm saying? All the niggas doing their thing, you know what I'm saying? New Motown. Shout out my niggas, you know what I'm saying? Lifeline Nation, you know what I'm saying? New, new Motown, you know what I'm saying? Rackets, you know what I'm saying? We all doing our thing, you feel me? Shout out New Motown, Lifeline Nation, you feel me? All my niggas, you feel me? Savage. What's your shit? Lavish Savage, man. Lavish Savage, you feel me? Shout out my nigga Squirm, Lavish Savage doing this thing, you feel me? All my niggas. You feel me? I, I got love for my city, just like my city got love for me. I support who support me. You feel me? If you ain't supporting me, then I don't support you. Nigga, fuck you. If you don't support me, it is what it is, bro. I got love for my city. Detroit versus everybody. Man, niggas keep on reporting my Instagram page. I'm getting DMs and shit from motherfuckers saying niggas report my page. I guess because I'm pouring up too much juice. You feel me? I guess. I guess. That's the only reason I can think of, you feel me? But I don't give a fuck about that shit. That shit petty. Like I said, I ain't hurt nobody but my body, baby. I'ma still continue to do me regardless. Is my Instagram page or not? They shut me down, they shut me down. Oh well, I ain't worried about that shit. Niggas let that social media shit get to them, man. For real, that shit lit. Niggas live by social media. That shit funny. Funny. Uh, yeah, man. Actually, I got this pending case, you know what I'm saying? Depending on what that is, what they say, you know what I'm saying? I might go to rehab. If they drop the case, then fuck no, I ain't going to rehab. You feel me? I'm really just, you know what I'm saying, trying to go to rehab. You know what I'm saying? They gonna knock a couple couple days, you know what I'm saying? You know how that shit go. But, you know what I'm saying? If they drop my case, no. If they don't drop my case, yeah, I'll be in rehab for sure. No doubt. Oh. Yo, yo, yeah, man, I'm waiting, I'm trying to get a haircut. Oh. What's going on? Okay, I'm on, I'm on my way to you now, Unc. I'm like three minutes away, right here, turn the corner. Okay, alright, well, give me about, uh, I'm at County in Progress, so give me, uh, give me about five minutes. 
I mean. Okay, cool. Just call me once you make it there, huh? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay, no doubt. What was that question again? Oh, how can I be rich? Oh yeah, man. Follow me on Instagram, Donnie Boy, D O N N I E B O I I underscore at the end. You know what I'm saying? Facebook, Roy Raps Donnie, R O Y A L R A P S Donnie, D O N N E I E. You feel me? Uh, and you know, my hitter, the Cracker Three Thousand, of course. You can always hit me here. Yeah, that's how you can reach me. Even though you don't answer that motherfucker. I Ever. always answer. Ever. I, I always answer the phone. Amen. I don't always answer the phone. It's no doubt. Got a better chance to catch Barack Obama on the line. <laughs> you know, we're going to have some more shit coming, man. Thank God and Jesus. The disco shit, man. It's Juice Nation, bitch. MPL. What up, Woodier? That boy there. What up, Pops? What up, dudes? Because a lot of motherfuckers say we ain't giving no shout outs. Hold on, because we got to give a lot of shout outs. Okay, man. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Right. Shout out that boy there, Woo. Shout out Footsie Woodsy. Shout out all my niggas. Shout out Pinch. Shout out my nigga. Uh, shout out my man Casper. Shout out my man Shout out my nigga K. Shout out my nigga Kate. D uh, my nigga all my uh, Carl. niggas. Hey, Billy, shout out my nigga. Uh, Bone, of course, the hell, brother. My yeah, nigga Louis B, bitch, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Shout out all my real niggas. You know what I'm saying? Who my been nigga, there, my Vince, nigga Vince, Juice. Juice. Nico, Nico, JT, Pierce, everybody, dog. Cashmere. Shout out all my niggas, dog. Captain yeah. and Christian. All my niggas, you feel um, me? Big B, all, all my, my niggas, baby, it's all love. Uncle Yacht, Yanni and Carl. Yeah, niggas show love, I show love. Lil Jordan, Mario, 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 Mario,